friends nice to meeting you all on my channel i am ps reddy cg artist having uh, 20 plus years industry experience uh, today we will see how this golden scorpion is brought here so basically it was modeled in gbrush and then exported into keyshot i have also uh, made a little bit uh, uh, compositing shot of a camera turnaround animation if you look here the camera is turning around so these are all different image sequences imported into after effects so okay fine uh, let us see uh, into the gbrush how it is modeled so i have modeled uh, this uh, scorpion so in different body parts basically its body was modeled if you look at here its legs is di different is thing is different and every uh, body part is uh, individually modeled and then I have integrated them into one uh, mesh object like this so for this I have is different uh, uh, sculpting brushes sculpting techniques and remeshing techniques so like this and finally it was uh, uh, made into a single mesh object so you can uh, also modify the topology using different uh, uh, remeshing techniques that is available in gbrush today it's time to export our mesh so for exporting uh, in different formats so here we have an option called export on the right side of the tool palette so if you look at here so we have different uh, formats it can be exported so one is obj format and uh, another is a uh, ma dot ma maya format and uh, another one is dot x3d format also it is time to export our object into different uh, object formats so for exporting here we have uh, an option called exporting on the right side of the tool palette just press export here we can see different uh, export format options like obj and uh, dot ma which is maya format and uh, third one is web 3d standard format so let us export this time uh, dot obj format which is object format uh, give some name here i have given body one say save yeah our object is exported now let us uh, open the same file in keyshot so for um, we have to import it into Keyshot. Just uh, say import from the file menu. Import. Yeah, we can see our uh, file is seen. Say import. And see, the mesh is imported, but no material is assigned to it. It is the default shader of Keyshot. Now let us assign a material. Uh, from the uh, materials palette so you can apply any material to it very easy anybody can do it so but we want a golden material just uh, take a material and drag onto the object it is applied instantaneously you can also turn around see uh, how the material uh, look like if you look at the controls of materials, camera, lighting, environment, so on the right side of this uh, window, so we have different palettes for uh, scene, uh, material, environment, lighting, camera, image, etc. First, let us uh, see uh, how this material can be controlled. If you, oh, if you click on the material tab, so at the bottom of the tab, uh, we have a, a sphere in golden color. So it is our material color. Just double click on it. So here uh, we can see different uh, material options that are visible now. Uh, if you click on this color, you can change it to a different one. And here we have texture options. Uh, texture options also. So presently uh, we don't work on textures. And uh, now see uh, the lighting uh, options available. Here we have uh, different modes like performance mode, basic mode, uh, production mode, interior mode, or simulation mode. Each mode has different uh, parameters of rendering specifications. Now 
when we uh, look at the environment tab so we have uh, an HDR editor so wherein we can manipulate the environment uh, of different brightness contrast blurriness and uh, um, lighting amount that is falling uh, from the sky uh, here we have uh, two uh, controllers like uh, tilt and rotation of environment just we can interactively see how best they are useful to us while manipulating yeah, yeah we have you have to uh, uh, interactively manipulate it until you satisfy uh, with the settings Here is our uh, 3D Scorpion ready. So even if it is cold, uh, even if it is Scorpion, if it is cold, so it looks crazy, isn't it? Let's see how uh, beautiful it is. So here we can adjust the brightness, contrast values. So here, if we come uh, to this lighting tab, so we have different options like uh, performance. Uh, mode basic mode product mode like this In the uh, image mode we have uh, options called brightness contrast by adjusting the brightness contrast you can get the image uh, uh, manipulation, the depth and the brightness you need like this. If you want further modification in the material, just select the material color. Yeah. Mm, you can control the environment also. If you want lighting environment, it will be bright. If you want a colored environment, now it is black can change this environment to whatever color you need and uh, you can also change into a different uh, image background also uh, you can select any background and, uh, let us take uh, let's see here is in different backdrop if you want it just in black color you can just say color this is how we can uh, render any uh, 3d uh, file in keyshot so nice for watching and if you like this uh, video please subscribe my channel thank you have a nice day.